Hello, I am Travis Spengler with UFC, and we are going to discuss document capture in plain English. Now this is the second part of our series, so please feel free to review the first part, which is an introduction to the document capture process. In this video, we will be reviewing the document capture process quickly. We'll be discussing how data is extracted, or what we call pulled from documents. And then lastly, we'll be discussing the different extraction techniques that are used which are OCR, ICR, and OMR. And we'll go into detail for each of those. As we discussed in the first video, there are five basic steps to document capture. The first is capturing the document, and that's when we put the document in its digital form. This is sometimes done by scanning the document or faxing it or even uploading it from a computer. The second step is classifying the document. And that is when we separate the document into pages and then make sure that they're ordered correctly. The third step is indexing the document, and that's where we assign values to the document that will help us reference it at a later time. Sometimes this is called tagging, and tagging, and other times it's called metadata for a document. The fourth step is verifying the document, which is making sure that the values entered in step number three are accurate. Then the last step is archiving the document, and that is when we put the document in its final stored system, and sometimes we refer to that system as a document management system. But today we are going to discuss how steps number two, three, and four are done using software that automatically pulls data off of documents. Sometimes we refer to that software as forms processing software. As I mentioned, forms processing is when we extract or pull the data off the documents. That data is then used for indexing, or we call it tagging, of the document. And it's usually done by software that can interpret or recognize machine print, hand print, barcodes, keywords, and other types of items on a document. Before we dig in though, you should understand that there are three different trade-offs to this process. The first is cost, the second is speed, and the third is accuracy. But let's talk about the software that is used to recognize data on documents. Well, there are three different types of software techniques that are commonly used in the data capture process. The first is optical character recognition, which is known as OCR. The second is intelligent character recognition, which is known as ICR. And the third is optical mark recognition, which is known as OMR. Now I want to point out to you that this recognition software utilizes proprietary technology that is continually getting better and improving. So OCR is software that matches characters on documents to computer characters or fonts. So let's look at this example. We have a piece of paper that has the words this is a sample sentence typed on it. Well, OCR takes those typed characters off the document and turns it into text that can be used any way we want it. So some examples we would use OCR for are to grab an invoice number off of an invoice or to grab a tracking number off of a shipping receipt. The next type of recognition software is ICR. ICR matches handwritten characters on documents to computer characters or fonts. So let's look at this example. Well, here we have a piece of paper with the words, this is a sample sentence, handwritten on it. So ICR takes those handwritten characters off the document and turns them into actual text that can be used any way we want it. ICR is similar to OCR, but it's focused on that handwritten text. The last type of recognition software is OMR. OMR software captures marks or special marks on documents. Some examples of these marks could be signatures, boxes, check marks, and if you've ever seen a Scantron document, you'll recall that they are very structured and they have boxes and lines and colors. Well, those boxes and lines and colors actually do have a purpose. They are so that when we use the OMR software, we can recognize the different responses on the form. Now, here are some common forms processing software. We have Abbey Flexi Capture and Abbey Recognition Server. Abbey Fine Reader, these three pieces of software are world-class OCR, ICR, and OMR software. Now just a special note, our company UFC has designed a web-based capture system which combines this world-class software, Abbey, with a, another capture software which is called Quillix. So please contact us if you would like to see this world-class system. So here's once again our document capture process diagram which includes an adjustment for forms processing. So you might be asking, well what happens if the forms processing software doesn't read some values correctly? 
Well, that's why we have step number four, which is our verify step. At the verify step, we make sure that the values that were pulled from the software in step number three are accurate and then submitted correctly. Well, that wraps up the second part of our document capture in plain English series. If you have any questions on this material or would happen to like a demo of the forms processing software, please contact us using this information. Thank you.